Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is uh, Code Blockly, uh, Blockly Google Code. Uh, I have created this oh, this application. Um, I don't think this block may only. Oh, look, that it's got um, it's got uh, rollovers for information. That would be nice if you could. Um, oh, look, you could add comments here. Let's see, add comment, test, test. I'm trying to type into it, but it's not working. Yeah, comments are not working. But anyway, I ran it, um, and it looks like it's seized up there. I ran it as Python, and this is what it produces, def factorial. So, Create the function called factorial global n. Why global n? Oh, get n. Um, I'm trying to reproduce this piece of code here, uh, which you can see running here. Def factorial n if n equals one. Apparently, Google Blockly doesn't have an if else statement, and it looks like it's not going to work for me at all. Uh, but uh, yeah. This is Udacity, and here's the code. Here's Google Blockly, and here's the code. But it doesn't, obviously, it's not going to work in its current state. Uh, mostly, well, there's lots of reasons. First is there if and there's no if then, and this break. Um, I don't need a break, I need an if then. I've got an if then, or rather an if else, like this. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, these two tools, if uh, Google Blockly and, for example, Udacity or Codecademy got together, that would be fabulous. Thanks for watching and happy computing.